so this weekend on Saturday the 21st we have two sensory friendly performances of the show Shh, we have a plan um, they're at 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. and the whole goal of, of putting on a sensory friendly performance is to welcome in um, people in the community who may have been diagnosed with autism or have other sensory deficits and they need a more relaxed welcoming accepting environment for sensory friendly performance it's actually perfect because we use no language in the show apart from to go and it's that kind of makes it perfect in that the music leads the show and visually it's just a stunning piece of work that the audience the children and their families can just sit back relax and get swept away in this physical performance we, what we find in a sensory performance is that we bring down the sound a little bit to a comfortable level for everyone the lighting can be adjusted slightly so that there's no bright flashing lights, so that everything is peaceful. And also, I will come out at the start of the show in a sensory friendly performance and I'll introduce myself and I'll talk to the audience and make sure, and we'll check the sound we'll together, we'll check the lights and we make sure that, I make sure that everyone's okay before we begin. The, the point of offering a sensory friendly performance is that we want our community to know that everybody is welcome here. We want the arts to be accessible for anyone in our community who wants to experience the arts.